Hey there my friend, this is Dave Wood talking to you from my little video office in the mountains in Escazú, Costa Rica. My purpose in this video on the login page is actually to give you a ritual to help put you in the state of mind that you need to be in to succeed in your business. Now here's what I want you to do after you watch this video. I want you to do this every time you ever log into this site. All right, so you might need to watch this video a few times after that. It's going to be a habit. Now, quick background on where this is coming from. Back in 1999, I started taking Kung Fu in a school. Now, in Chinese, if you're wondering why the name of this video, I'm actually going to tell you at the end if you stick around. Well, when I was in Kung Fu, uh, they were really particular about a lot of strange things. One of the things they wanted us to do as an example was they actually wanted us to wear the same clothes every day that we ever went to class. They wanted us to wear the same shirt, okay? Not like the same looking shirt. I'm talking about the actual same shirt. So if we had a shirt, they actually wanted us to wear that same one every single day. They actually wanted us to wear the same pants to school every single day. When we walked into the school, they actually wanted us to walk in the same and they actually had a little ritual that you did when you started. When you got into class, when you started the class, all right, they started the class in the exact same way with the same drills. Now there's a reason for this and I'm going to get to it in a bit. When I was the younger, I think I was like 12 years old, I took basketball. And one of the things that they taught us when they were teaching us how to shoot free throws was they said that if you really want to be good at free throws, if you want to land your shots every time, there's a system that all the best basketball players in the world follow. And the system might vary from person to person, but the reality is they're doing the same thing. And here's what professional basketball players do when they're dribbling and when they're looking at the hoop, right? They actually go through an exact step-by-step -step ritual before they actually even will attempt the shot. Now, what I used to do, and this is one of the things they, they taught us to do, is I'd dribble the ball three times. And then I'd hold the ball in a special way. And then I'd close my eyes and I would see the hoop and I would see the shot. And then after that I would breathe in a certain way and at the same spot in the breath, that is when I'd make the shot. Now this leads me into the future when, you know, I'm like 25 years old and I started studying neurolinguistics programming. And one of the things that they taught me is they taught me something called anchors. Basically what it is, is if you're in the same emotional state and you repeat a movement with your body, if you're in the same emotional state and you repeat a movement with your body, eventually repeating that movement with your body will get you into that same state when you're in your peak performance. That's why basketball players, they want to move the same way before they make a free throw because what it will actually do is it will fire off in their brain an alpha state and that spike in alpha waves in their brain will make it so they'll abnormally land their shots most of the time, right? And so what we're going to do is a little getting into state drill. Why? Because whenever you enter into this website, this is not a normal website. This is a quoon. And what is that? It's a place of learning. It's a school in Chinese. That's what they call our Kung Fu school. And when you enter into this website, I want you to be in a learning state, a state of focus. I want you to be focused on your outcome when you come in to this special place. And so there's a few states that I want you to anchor with me. And then I'm going to tell you about this cool little ring that I've got on my left finger and what it means to you. So here's what we're going to do first of all. Whenever you're building your business, you want to be op operating in a state of belief or a state of faith. What does that mean? It means this is a time when you want to be believing in a future that hasn't happened yet. You want to be believing in something that you can't see, right? And so what I want you to do really quick is I want you to allow your mind to form a symbol for the word belief, for the word faith, believing in something that hasn't happened yet. And when you've got a symbol, I just kind of want you to project it out in front of you. And I want you to see that image. For me, you know, I grew up Mormon. And so I got this gigantic picture of like a scripture book in front of my mind in three dimensions when I imagine the word belief. I want you to see that image in front of you, see that symbol in front of you. And then here's what I want you to do. Close your eyes just for a second. And I want you to imagine that symbol that for you represents faith. Don't just imagine it though. I want you to make the colors in the symbol bright. I want you to pull out the dimensions in the symbol. I want you to make it three-dimensional. I want you to stretch out the symbol. I want you to make it larger in your imagination. 
And it's, if it moves, it moves. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But here's what I want you to do. I want you to imagine a time when you were operating in belief. And I want you to feel that feeling of belief in your body. And I want you to turn that feeling of belief, that faith, up in your body of believing in something that you haven't accomplished yet. And I want you to just hold that there for a moment. Now we're going to move to the next emotion, okay? And you could go and spend more time on this, take notes, and you could just do this ritual on your own. Now we're going to go to a state of total focus. Look, we're all, you know, around distractions all the time. You probably got Facebook opened up in another window. Whenever you come into this site, I want you to shut down everything but this site as a part of the ritual, and there's a reason for that. If you come into this space and you allow yourself to be distracted, you are going to be programming yourself that when you come to this place, you're going to allow yourself to be distracted. And so what I want you to do is the exact opposite. What I want you to do is I want you to imagine a state of focus, all right? So what I want you to do right now is just allow your mind to come up with a symbol, a symbol that means total and complete focus. I'm talking, man, about a time when you were in the zone. I'm talking talking about the time when there was nothing but what was in front of you. I'm talking about a time when you were accomplishing something with all your energy. I'm talking about a time when you felt on fire and all you saw was this outcome, this aim in front of you of something that you want to accomplish. And for me, you know, this might be a little bit weird, but I just kind of see like this giant eye. That's like, that, that's like my symbol for focus, right? But I want you to imagine that symbol in front of you and just for a second, close your eyes. Imagine the symbol in front of you, the symbol of total and complete focus. And now what I want you to do is I want you to make that symbol bigger. I want you to allow your mind to return to that state of total and complete focus. I want you to pull out the colors in that symbol, make it bright, make it three-dimensional, allow it to stand out in space. And as you're staring at it, allow your mind to go to this space where all there is, all there is is what's in front of you, your outcome, and this. I want you to stare into that, feel your mind come into focus, and make a commitment that every time you come into this site, you are going to enter into the space of total and complete focus. Now open your eyes, right? Now you can spend more time on that. The longer you hold the image, the more powerful the, the symbol is going to become, and the faster this will work for you when you come in here in the future, all right? Next one that we're going to go to is a learning state. Now, we learned something actually is really interesting, uh, and we learned this actually in karate. We also learned this in kung fu. When you are focusing, okay, there's this state called look at nothing, see everything. What's that? It's where you're seeing what's in front of you, and really you're opening your mind to peripheral vision, right? Where you allow your mind not only to see what you're noticing with your eyes, but also to kind of see everything that comes in through the perception. For example, if you kind of allow your eyes to go into a soft gaze as you look in this video, you'll also see the edges of your computer. You'll also see all the way, if you put your fingers on the side, I can see my fingers moving on the side like this. I can actually even see my toes a little bit you know, uh, as I'm sitting here like this, I can see my arms moving even though they're way off in peripheral vision. That's called a soft focus and when you go into that, what happens, it allows you to go into a learning state. I want you to allow yourself to go into that now and allow your mind to come into a state of learning, of being willing to learn and to try new things, new strategies, new marketing techniques, new things that you haven't thought of before to help you hit that outcome. And I want you to allow your mind to form a symbol for learning. When I form a symbol for learning, my symbol, and yours could be anything, is a symbol of open hands because I'm ready to receive new knowledge as I hold out my open hands. And I imagine that symbol of those open hands. Now, whatever your symbol is, is okay, but I want you to allow it to form. Now go ahead and close your eyes. And I want you to see that symbol. And I want you to turn the colors up in that symbol. I want you to make it more big. I want you to stretch it out. I want you to make it three-dimensional. And as you're looking at it, I want you to imagine yourself and feel what it feels like in your body as you breathe softly and you become focused, full of faith, in a state of learning. That's right. Just like that. Now open your eyes again, all right? Now here's the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to imagine an outcome together, which brings me to the ring, right? No, I'm not Golem and I'm not from the Lord of the Rings, but I wear this ring and this ring is actually a symbol that I use. And what it's a symbol for, for me, is my outcome because my outcome and my goal as the founder of Empower Network is to help create 100 new millionaires a year. So this is actually a ring that we give to people when they hit our millionaires club. Now obviously we have an income disclosure. I am not guaranteeing that you'll get in the 
in, uh, the Millionaires Club or make any money, see empowernetwork.com forward slash income.php. This is my goal, this is my outcome, and I want you to share it with me. And if you don't want to share this outcome, that's okay. You can just imagine a symbol for your outcome, and that's going to be just as powerful for you. Because ultimately, my goal is to help you get what you want. And this is the last thing we're going to do together before you go ahead and log into the site. Now, this might seem like a lot, but in the future, this will be done by in about 30 seconds once you get the hang of it. I want you to go through this lit ritual every time you ever come to this special place. I want you to treat this like a place, it's like a sanctuary online where you're here only to accomplish your goals and outcomes. And that's the only reason you're here. And when you're not in that state, leave the site. Go somewhere else. Go on Facebook. Go on Twitter. But when you're ready to reach your outcome, you want to come to this place and enter into this special state. All right? So this ring, here's what it is. On one side, it has the date that you joined. For me, the date I joined was October 27, 2011. It was the pre-launch, first enrollment, and the date I hit a million dollar commissions. On the other side, February 17, 2012, on the front, we've got 250 diamonds, and then we've got a thing that says Millionaire's Club, and we give these to people who cross a million dollars in commissions. Right, right now, as of making this video, I believe we have 11. We're you know, come up with a new one every, every month or so these days. So here's what I'm going to do for a second, is I want to imagine an outcome with you before you come into the site. And here's what I use as my symbol, is I use this ring. And I see this ring giant, three-dimensional. So we're going to go ahead and show you a close-up of the ring. It's got the Empower symbol in there. I want you to see the diamonds. I want you to see the place that has Millionaire Ring. I want you to see the date that you joined. I want you to see the date that you crossed a million dollars in commissions in your mind. Bright, three-dimensional, Technicolor, blow it up, right? And hold that in front of you and hold those emotions in your mind as you're seeing that and just close your eyes for a second. And as you're seeing that ring, I want you to blow up that symbol. I want you to blow up that image. I want you to make it bigger and I want you to feel that feeling that you feel as you look at it. I want you to step back in to that feeling of faith, believing that you can accomplish things that are yet unseen. I want you to step back into that feeling of focus, of focusing all of your energy, all of your internal energy and your external resources on hitting your outcome. I want you to step back into that learning state, being willing to receive feedback and learn new things as you press forward towards your outcome. And as you're doing that, I want you to hold that image of that million dollar ring in your mind. I want you to make it bigger. I want you to see the diamonds in it. I want you to see the light glitterings from the diamonds. I want you to hold that in your mind and I want you to say, I am going to hit my outcome right now. That's it. Period. Now, go ahead and log in to the site. Welcome back to EmpowerNetwork.com. Do this every time you log in. It will dramatically change your energy, your focus, your results, and how you feel when you're here. I promise you, it'll be just like when I used to go to that Kung Fu school. You'd walk in that place and instantly go into state. See you on the inside.